I'm Amy. Thank you so much for joining me on the Breathe and Play Everyday YouTube channel to learn about making the art that we used in our yoga story. The yoga story that we did talked about the way that you can see the world through different colored lenses. Like when you have on your rose colored lenses, things can feel really happy. Or when you have on your green colored glasses, things can feel really calm. And at the end of the story, we talked about how you actually need all the feelings to come together in your heart. And we need all these ways of seeing the world. And you can learn to make this one too in the other video that I have up on YouTube from that story. So the first thing you'll need to make your very own pair of glasses is this template. And I'm so grateful to firstpalette.com for making this template available to download and print for free. They have all different funny shapes to choose from like flowers and hearts and ovals and cat size. So have fun choosing the glasses that you wanna make. And then you'll be cutting out the, uh, the glasses and cutting out the center of them. Super easy to construct once they're cut out. You'll want to trace this template onto a heavier material for our project. You can use a grocery bag or cardstock, or even get a piece of paper, um, construction paper to trace it on. And that way you can just glue your template onto the construction paper to make it a little bit stronger. Then once you have that cut out and your template is all cut out, Time to construct it. Just taking some glue and putting it onto the very tips of the eyeglasses. Make sure they're the right way so that they could go over your ear like that. And then you have your glasses. The paper versions are so quick and easy to make and they're really ready to color and you can just go with that if you want. So these are the ones that my helpers made. They're great and they're really fast and easy. If you wanna use your heavier cardstock, there's a couple of ways that you can make the inside of the glasses color. I just found some tissue paper from old presents and things that I had laying around the house and I taped them onto the lenses of my glasses. You can't see through them. So if you're going to wear these glasses around, it's kind of like having a blindfold on. I can't see you. I can't see what crazy or silly faces you're making at me right now. I'm completely blindfolded. But I thought it might be fun to show you a way that you can make a pair of these glasses that you could see through the lenses. So I'm going to use this sturdier pair that another one of my helpers made. And I'm going to take a piece of regular packing tape and place it over the lens right here in the front. Just like that. I want to make sure it's pretty flat and smooth and covering all the edges. Then I'm going to take some food coloring and I'm going to place one drop right on the center of the lens. Drop. Taking another piece of packing tape, I'm going to place it on the back of the lens, creating a little bit of a seal. And then start to spread the food coloring around with my fingers. It can be fun to kind of squish it and move it. And if you find like you don't have enough food coloring on it, 
You can always kind of restart by undoing the tape. The lighter colors are obviously going to be lighter. I'll do the other one a darker color. So again, taking my piece of packing tape, putting it at the front, making sure that I have a good seal. And then I'm going to take the rose colored glasses. Those were so fun. And make a couple of drops on that. Give it a seal with another piece of tape. And I'm going to squish that around with my fingertips. It's really fun to watch the food coloring move around inside the tape. And again, the more food coloring you add, the darker this color of lens will be. I'm just going to take my scissors and shave around the edges of my lenses, taking off all that extra tape. And now I've created some lenses that I can actually see through and are colored, so it kind of colors the world for me. I have one eye happy, woo, and one eye brave. I'm feeling very happy and brave. And then for decorations, you can really let your imagination go wild. In mine, I found an old flower from a dress we weren't using anymore, some stickers that were in the sticker bin, a couple of gems. You can really let your imagination play with this idea of how to decorate your very own lenses. I hope you have fun. And if you get to make a couple of different pairs, bring it to the yoga story and uh, try, try out the yoga story with your very own pair of glasses. Thanks so much for joining me, everybody. Have fun.